other side of losers' quarters right now is this. Uh, who are these two? Oh, this is John Ace. Mark versus. Oh, this is not. This is his quarters. This is. Quarters. Um. Wait, is this quarters? Yep. This yes, quarters. Right, right. Yeah. Ace for Tina Mark. See, this is a funny thing where like both the characters, both, all of their uh, approach options are mad committal. Yeah. But I feel like that Kirby was floating in a uh, like slow motion. It seems so slow. Oh, I'm actually curious about this interaction. I want to see like when Kirby upbeats the ledge if it shoots the thing. What happens with which time? Um, I'm pretty sure he would get like which time, but then he would grab the ledge pretty quickly and get invincibility. invincibility. Yeah. yeah. All right. Off to a strong start for Ace. Ooh. Yeah, but this is one of the trickier things. That Bayonetta, how does she kill a Kirby? Normally one of Bayonetta's best kill options is... Are you kidding oh, me? No, he, he air dodged the ledge and didn't get there. How did that not... That Okay, he just got robbed. He yeah. got robbed by the freaking game right there. That yeah. He should not have died from that. That is super unfortunate for him. Yeah. Especially because normally, like surviving against Kirby is kind of one of the big names of the game. You know, he, he can kill you, he has kill moves, but uh and all of a sudden, yeah, no, he's he's kinda he's kinda triggered right now. He's approaching in ways that he should not be and he was not before. Yeah, the real kill options here are up tilt back air stuff and then like uh jab attack uh jab, jab like forward throw ledge also and forward well. throw, yeah. Bash attack too will kill. And jab. Kirby is light, and at these higher percent at least, ops things open up for him. Uh, game was looking so good early on, now he kind of is falling apart a little bit. But yeah. you have a lot of options to kill right here. It's like, he, you see him fit for that rapid jab? He, he did jab one and then got caught out. Wow, without any rage, that dash attack is not enough to do it that time around. And, oh, this is the sort of thing where at low percents, if you get caught by one of Kirby's tilts, you might take a whole heap of damage. Oh, that's a lock. Oh, ba 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 ba. Okay. I think he angled it up, and that's why it missed. I have no idea. I feel like that should have, that up smash should have connected. Tijon Mark is doing a really good job of catching him in between kill options. So, so, so what he's he's done in the last like three times Ace went for a kill option is it's like fish for kill option one, like buff for kill option two, and he's getting caught in between those two options. Oh, yeah. Okay, so at this point, you know, technically speaking, Arrow does have paths to victory. Uh, but they mainly involve silly things happening off stage or at yeah. the top of the screen. And it feels like John Mark is playing around that beautifully right now. I'm not trying to get hit by any of those really devastating combo starters, as I, I say, as yeah, he gets hit by. ABK, yeah? yeah, it's not going to be enough to kill, though. You know, Bayo combos do nice damage, but that's death. Yeah. He went for the witch time there. He's like, if you run up and down tilt or dash attack, I kill you for it. Witch time F smash or what? Uh, probably F smash. Witch time F smash probably die. I'm actually willing to see that. I'm pretty sure that how the F smash is shaped. If you witch time uh, Kirby point blank and you don't dash back, the F smash will go over him. Like I don't think cause it's like a it's like a downward angle. I think the pop. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you could always just up tilt it to F smash. Let's show. I think uh, I think that game could have gone so different if that air dodge to ledge actually landed on the ledge. I think he kind of just pressed the forward button after that. So we'll we'll, we'll see how game two goes. Yeah, yeah. All right, this could, in fact. I mean, it could also. It, it, I feel like yes, a big statement in that game was the fact that. Uh, Arrow was just holding forward, but at the same time, it did feel like John Mark had a good read on what he was doing. It's, it, I understand, you know, maybe he lost his composure, but it did also feel like there were a lot of things that John Mark was doing that were just like very good answers to what Ace was looking for. That was really good. That's a reset on, on fair one too. And then using that to cross up and get an up tilt. All right. I we feel like sexy they Kirby in the building. I, 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 <gasps> oh, that what was, was that DI, dude? That killed. That freaking that killed, dude! Smash. I don't think he was ready to get hit by that either. I feel like they, they have like the same game plan, right? They have like 
the run up down tilt. Kirby looks so ridiculous upside down. <laughs> does he actually have gun shoes when he does it? He, uh, no, I think he just. Oh, oh my god, he doesn't go upside down at all. He just, no, he, he went just upside down the other time. I think it depends really? if you hold it or not. I think he only goes upside down if you hold it. Really? Oh. We will have to uh, check back in later. Yeah. So, Ace managing to take that stock. I, I think that that's really important. Uh, last time around, he was struggling to take even that first stock, and things really ran away from him. So this time around, the fact that he, uh, you know, ooh, the fact that he's able to um, at least even up the stock count, I mean, it's still going to be rough for him. He's, you know, he's the one who needs to be approaching. He's the one who needs to be making things happen. And when that's the case, oh, man, you just, yeah. <laughs> You know, committal approaches, that's the sort of thing that can happen to you. I can't believe he's out there. He missed his triple jump. Uh, oh, man. Things get pretty yeah. rough for Arrow right now. Yeah, DJ Mark really aware that, like, what, what Bayo like to do is the dash attack will cross up so they'll instantly ABK back, but there is time to punish it if you're close enough. Oh, yeah. Keeps going for that stone. I understand why. At the same time, it has not been working. <laughs> to be honest, I'd like to see like a, a reversal on that with how low he's going with the stone. <gasps> okay, that air dodge works so edge. <laughs> yeah, this is commanding for Dijon Mark. That dash attack is not enough to kill, but like. Yeah, he doesn't. He doesn't need much more at this point. Up, up throw is close to killing. In fact, maybe not on town and city, but like with one more hit, like he goes into up throw or up throw range. And once your opponent has a kill throw available, then things get so much harder. So not, not, not to take anything away from like uh, Dijon Mark and like the parry game, but I feel like short characters that are so small, especially if they're if they're gonna crouch, they have such an easier time parrying because.